Birds Canada is once again asking residents to help them take stock of winter bird populations through their great backyard bird count, a program that helps conservationists better understand how the animals are affected by habitat loss and climate change. And with an unseasonably warm winter here in Winnipeg and in many parts of the country, many of our feathered friends are deciding to stick it around all year long. There have been lots of birds that have stayed throughout the winter that don't traditionally stay. Paula Grief, a volunteer with the Delta Marsh Bird Observatory, says Manitobans can normally expect to spot sparrows, chickadees and woodpeckers throughout the winter months. But with the warming temperatures, less species than ever have felt the need to fly south. There's a, a bird called a belted kingfisher. It eats fish uh, and hunts for fish in along rivers. Well. This is the first year ever we've had one that I know of uh, in Winnipeg because there's open water. This warm weather has definitely affected migration. Grief says the bird count helps provide a snapshot of how bird populations, behaviors and environments change year by year. In December, there's a Christmas bird count that goes on again across North America and that gives us a snap snapshot early winter. This is a little bit later in winter, giving us a similar snapshot, but more widespread. And for those taking part in this weekend's count, Grief says winter is the perfect time to get started with bird watching. A backyard is even the better place to start. Uh, you can put up a feeder with black oil sunflower seeds and you're going to attract something, but there aren't lots of species, so it's easier to figure them out, which, you know, everybody loves a little success. It makes you feel good and, <laughs> and it, it, it encourages you to explore further and have fun, like really enjoy what's coming to your backyard because it, it can be spectacular. In Winnipeg, Kurt Black, City News.